Thank you, Carla. Um, the Tánaiste uh, is only too well aware of the uh, uncertainty and the anxiety experienced by many thousands of lower paid workers uh, in sectors of the economy, such as the hospitality sector, uh, when Justice Feeney uh, struck down the statutory wage setting mechanisms uh, as unconstitutional. Uh, the many thousands of citizens who depend uh, on the JLC system to set a fair and decent uh, wage uh, for them and their families demanded a swift uh, response to that particular decision uh, from the government. Uh, and I'm pleased to say uh, that the legislation that the programme outlined yesterday uh, shows very clearly that the government has delivered on that promise. Can I ask the Tánaiste to outline to the House um, a clear time frame for the introduction uh, of the legislation uh, to restore uh, the Joint Labour Committee system? Tánaiste. Yes, well, as the Deputy has said, the uh, High Court uh, struck down, um, uh, for reasons of the Constitution, the JLC uh, REA system, which uh, had been in place uh, to provide statutory regulation and protection uh, to, in the main, workers in a number of sectors of the economy. Uh, the government uh, is introducing uh, legislation uh, to restore the JLC uh, uh, REA uh, system and to ensure that those workers will continue to have uh, legal protection uh, of their um, uh, pay and conditions. Uh, that legislation is, uh, it will be published uh, this session. Uh, the heads of the bill are being prepared, uh, or have been prepared by the um, uh, Department of Jobs, Enterprise and Innovation, um, uh, agreed by government, and the Attorney General has been asked to give the highest priority to the drafting of the legislation.